What's up everyone, it's Mike from MyGadget as well and today's video is about the 8K gaming PC and using it on TV 8K because that's the only option we have right now. No monitor right now can do 8K. So this TV is right in front of another TV. That's my old LG OLED uh, E6 that's going to be replaced by this. So I've already put it up there and as soon as I sell it, um, the LG will go. So it's a QLED TV 8K 850TS and then in front of that I have LG TV un not unboxed yet. It's going to be used for my FPS gaming for another PC setup. But there's a lot coming guys so make sure you guys subscribe to my channel so that you guys will be notified whenever I have the new video uploaded. Right extreme you see on the corner, that's my um, SVS uh, PB16 Ultra and right next to it, this is the gaming beast I got. It's MSI 3090 30X and it is in, in the Corsair 780 uh, T case because I wanted a big case so that my graphic card and all the peripherals you know, can breathe inside because it's uh, it produces a lot of um, heat, right? So this gaming setup is home theater setup kind of so i'm gonna be using these speakers for that surround sound and all that atmos and 3d sound so as you see this pc right here i unplugged and put it up here so that you can see how it looks when it's uh, powered on and uh, all these speakers home theater setup amplifier uh it's gonna be a great setup you know for the 8k gaming because most of the games that's gonna be coming out will utilize that atmos sound or the 3d sound or dtx uh, kind of maneuver that you can do with your uh with your pc if you go to the sound setting and select that this one lg oled i got it because it can do g-sync it can do free sync and that will be connected to another pc that i'll show you guys that pc is actually equipped with the rtx 3080 so that pc is gonna go there but Oh my goodness, when you hear this sound with the bass that it produces, when you're driving those cars and hitting those curbs and other cars, this is huge. And then these Atmos speakers give you that sound when you're playing the Forza Horizon and you mimic your sound as Atmos, you feel that that jet is flying over. So this is the one RTX 3080 I was talking about. This is going to go with the LG OLED C10 because that can do G-Sync. I see that QLED shows up also that it's G-Sync, but it's not G-Sync compatible uh, listed. So if you click on that, you're going to have some deficiency. So I would prefer not to use the QLED TV as G-Sync at all because it's not compatible certified. But this right here is NVIDIA G-Sync certified. So this is going to be used as my uh, FPS gaming. I actually use the FPS gaming. I have a Samsung G7, but I want to give it, um, give it a try on LG because some of the games just look stunning and outstanding on OLED but you can see those darker areas where enemies are hiding but this PC has 3900X processor it got the uh, Asus board inside I got the Noctua uh, Chromex black uh, air cooler I wanted to go with the liquid cooling but then I, I just wanted to give it a try to the um, the air cooler thanks to the Linus Tech Tip you know he convinced me to get one of these I don't have any hard drives in the hard drive bay because everything I'm using is solid state I have two NVMe solid state drives and got one, um, the SATA, uh, eSATA, uh, I don't know what they call it, but whatever it is, you know, the Samsung Evo 870. So that's right there at the back. And then everything else you can see in this computer is right in here, neat and clean. I'm using a 1000 watt power supply from EVGA. It's a Gold Plus certified. And um, the RAM I'm using is 3600 megahertz from the uh, Trident Z Skill uh, Neo. And this is my old gaming setup. I would call it it's my current gaming setup because all the gaming I do is actually happening on this one right here because I usually do the 1440p gaming and the room kind of look mess because there's everything is squeezed in here, guys. I have a lot of tech right now to review and make videos off. So that's why you will see that everything is squeezed in this media room. And this PC right here, I ordered from the CyberPower PC because, I mean, the card was sold out right away, right? So it was hard to get the card. So I ordered the PC. So the PC came with the RDX 3080. So I don't, instead of like paying to the, those scalpers on eBay, like 2000, why not just get a PC for 2000? And, you know, you get the card with it, it's score i7 processor, uh, it's unlocked, it's 1070, 700K. 
and um, it got 16 gigabyte of RAM, not really crazy high specs, but I mean, I can do my main gaming on this computer right here and editing. It's uh, it's one beast of a computer, RDX 3090. So if you guys have any questions, please let me know in the comment section and make sure guys subscribe to my channel, support me. Thank you so much for making me reach 6,000 subscribers. And I'll see you guys in another video with more content. Until then, peace out and please stay safe, stay home. Take care. Bye-bye.